Well, you do seem to form quite a bond on this set. I mean, it, it seemed like there was quite a sisterhood. Blake, you mentioned this before, but what was it like to work with Sama to build these characters? Oh my gosh, I was so lucky personally, personally and professionally to be able to work with her because, um, you know, I had such a, a challenging role in this film, you know, and, and to have somebody, and there were a lot of things that didn't make sense or that I didn't yet understand about the character, so to have somebody like Selma to be able to sit down with for hours, we would sit and work on these scenes with Oliver, without Oliver, and, and rewrite, and then just to like watch this woman personally and just like see how strong she is and, 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 and how much passion she brings to it, and she just makes everything make sense, <laughs> and um, you know, to have, you know, such a, a testosterone her own charge set and then to have this woman who's stronger than all of the men put together it was very it was very empowering <laughs> and, yeah. and for me well one thing that I it was I get turned on by talent I really do I mean I get fascinated I want to watch it I, I find it really interesting and I, I I think that it's really rare to find like in instincts and natural talent combined with professionalism and discipline, you know? Usually, like, I've seen actors that are really good, which are really disciplined and very professional, and then I I, I have seen this r raw talent that just, they're careless, and they don't care, and then they get there, and they're so good. And she has both. Mm -hmm. She has that instinct, the talent, but she also has the intelligence, you know, and the, the professionalism and the discipline. And she's so young, it was so rare to, to see all that. It was fascinating. <laughs> you know, while we were on the set, uh, everybody mentioned they didn't know what Oliver was going to be doing with this film. But now that we see it, it's so sexy and so dangerous. But now that you've seen it, how would you describe this movie to somebody? Sexy and dangerous, like yeah. you said. Yeah, it is. But it's also it's a love story, which is exciting because it um, it's a really violent male movie. But it's also it's also about love. You know, there's something Shakespearean about it, which is which is um, unbelievable in, in an Oliver Stone movie. And and you know, I love that. You know, the, the, between the relationships and, and the actual love relationships, and then the mother and the daughter, and and the people that work for each other, or the, the kidnapper and and and, and her victim. You know, Oliver's already got this legendary career, and this seems like a new step for him. I mm. mean, what what did he bring to this movie? What sort of style and vision did he bring to this movie? I think that he reinvented his own style in this movie. I mean, it is so young, it is new, it's completely refreshing. Um, it could have been done by some new genius, you know, like a 25-year-old new guy that it's the new genius. Uh, you can sense Oliver Stone in it, of course, but there is um, beauty in the way he interprets technology and who we are today and violence, that it's, it's poetic and different. Who is a savage in this movie? Me. You? We all Everyone. Yeah. <laughs> but also the audiences, too. That's that's what's yes. interesting, you know? It's it's interesting because for me, you know, you're looking at this young girl and you're thinking, how can she be with two men? You know, how can she do that? And you're sitting there judging her. And then it's turned around on yourself when you think, well, like, am I a part of this? Like, am, am I a part of the... the, the world that where relationships are so disposable where, where people hurt each other where, where there's so many broken marriages like am i a part of this this system where you know all of human interaction is is on a computer or a phone you know it's like am i a part of removing that and and you know that's what's neat is that the audience becomes becomes one of the savages <laughs>